What's going on everyone? I have got my BoxyCharm Premium Box for June. At least it's before the end of the month. Sorry, my phone's going off. All right, let's pop into this guy. So to be truthful, I knew one of the items because I got to pick it and it was the whole reason that I ended up staying with BoxyCharm this month because I was thinking of canceling premium. But when I saw this, I was like, okay, I have to stay. And that is this palette right here. This is the Dominique Cosmetics Transitions Palette. I had been eyeing this ever since it came out. I knew I wanted to buy it. I was just looking for a sale or a coupon or something. And so that makes the cost of this box totally worth it because this palette is around $48. The box is $35. So there you go. It's like getting it on sale plus everything else is going to be a bonus. So this is the transition palette from Dominique Cosmetics. Like I said, it's an all matte palette. Oh, it's so beautiful. And this is supposed to also be able to be used as everything you would need on your face from under eye brightening to eyebrows to eyeshadow, blush, bronzer, like the entire gamut. So I am so excited about this palette. I really enjoy Dominique Cosmetics and their formulas. In fact, I'm wearing Latte, a mix of Latte and Latte 2 palette on my eyes today. I just, I really think the products are really good. I would love to try more. So that palette was $48. So absolutely, I'm gonna say that the cost of the box is worth it this month. Everything else I'm considering a bonus, so let's go ahead and get into the bonus items. The next item in here is from Laura Mercier, and I happen to love Laura Mercier products, and this is going to be a blush. And this is in the color Grapefruit. Now, I don't know if you can tell, but this is a spicy, deep blush color and you know I'm kind of here for it and I kind of love it because I don't know what it is but lately I've actually really been into like orange and that has never been something I've been into before so blush is having its moment I know that this looks scary and intimidating but I'm thinking that if I go in with a light hand and a very floofy brush I think it's gonna be okay but I'm very excited about this I believe this is around $30 so let's go ahead and play the game you know the game we guess the prices and I'm almost always wrong. Uh, $32, hey, that was pretty good. Plus I knew the cost of the palette. So right there, that's pretty good right there. Okay, so this is from Earth Harbor and this says Laguna Replenishing Body Serum, Marine Algae and Blue Yarrow. I have no idea. So let's just read about this one. I have no idea, I guess on this one, 60 bucks? Laguna, nope, $26. <laughs> Just reverse that. $62? No, $26. And it is basically botanical oils and all sorts of goodness to basically have an aroma of florals and absorbs non-greasy. All right. Well, that sounds exciting because during the summertime, my skin does get super dry. So I'm excited. And if I liked it, it's not going to cost an arm and a leg. It's only $26 versus which a lot of the time BoxyCharm, you know, puts in something and says it's worth $60 from some skincare brand you've never heard of. All right, the next thing in here is from Lashaholic. These are luxury lashes. Honestly, these are super long. I don't know if I'll do that. We'll see here. But um, these are silk. So there's that. Yay, okay. Is there a style name? Cruelty Free Kiss Me. All right, this is the style Kiss Me from Lashaholic. I'm assuming it's probably $15. Let's take a look. $15.99, it's a new launch. Yes, luxury lashes. So I have to say I'm doing pretty well in this box. Okay, the next thing we have an eye cream. This is a coriander seed and marjoram eye cream from Mopillum. Mopillum, I don't know if I butchered that. I'm sorry if I did. Um, it's half an ounce. It says small, around, uh, small amount around the eyes, days and nights. Okay, eye cream, eye cream, eye cream. $39. I will say I'm more excited for the body thing and the latte palette. One last thing in this box. This is the Skin Regimen 1.85 HA Booster Hydro Plumping Concentrate. Okay. Um, so I'm guessing this is some sort of AHA. So skin resurfacing chemical exfoliant. I'm excited for that. This is a nice package. Let's take a look here. Is it in a dropper? Yes. So there we go. A few drops on the face followed by cream. 
That sounds good. Again, it's skincare. I'm sure it's probably $50, $60. So let's go ahead and take a peek. Skin regimen. Okay. $115. It's a hydrating serum with a concentrate of hyaluronic acid. Okay. Free from silicones and free from synthetic fa fragrances. So I don't think that's probably worth $115, but honestly, I don't really... This and the blush, these two things alone absolutely make me so excited to have this BoxyCharm Premium that I kind of don't care about everything else in the box. I'm fine with it. So I have to say all in all, I'm pretty pleased with this month, even though it's really two out of the five things that I'm enjoying. It's just because I really, really wanted this palette and I'm kind of into that orange color blush. So all in all, I'm gonna call it a win. We'll see um, if next month I continue to feel this way. And if it goes too far south too quickly, I think I would probably cancel. I'm getting to a point, I just have too much stuff anyway. So I continually get unimpressed with a lot of the stuff that comes it just builds up in my collection and so I think when you're first starting BoxyCharm and Ipsy and all of the subscription boxes if you're first into makeup you don't have a lot it's a great way to build up your collection but four years in you're just kind of like I have too much stuff just too much stuff and you get a lot of stuff that you know you're not going to use so a lot of it I can't even give away sometimes so I think yeah, I'm getting to the point where, yeah, I'm running out of space. I'm running out of interest in some of the items. So continually, we'll see how that goes, how much longer I'll continue to get a BoxyCharm. But let me know, what do you feel? Where are you with getting subscription boxes and how you feel about them? So put that down in the comments. Thank you for hanging out with me, and I'll see you all in another video very soon. Bye.